Hey guys, today on Nice Junk, it's going to be more boring than normal, but I'm sure you're used to boring videos if you're subscribed to me, which is awesome. I love having you, but we both know um, scrapping is scrapping, right? So anyways, today's video is going to be just about what's coming up and uh, a couple uh, scrap runs. You know, dedicated to E-Waste Mike. He loves, wow, uh, what does it weigh? What does it pay? So here you go, E-Waste Mike. What does it weigh? What does it pay? Should I say it again for you? Probably not. Um, anyways, so I'll tell you what I've been up to and uh, what's gonna be happening for the summer a nice chunk so i picked this up the other day customer was closing a store and said hey do you want some stuff and i said sure i like stuff and uh so what it is is a automatic thor auto magic sorry it's a thor auto magic gladiatron or gladiarn so I, so it's a Thor Auto Magic Glad Iron, and it's for ironing shirts. I know nobody wants one, but obviously they do. They're actually selling on eBay for two forty nine ninety nine, and there's been a couple of sold recently, and. Uh, so I was going to scrap it, but hey, I'm going to put it up for sale. If you're watching this, um, eBay, it's $249. Nice junk price, $100. Buck. Don't offer me $99. $100. I want a brown bill. I am not going down on that price. That is the nice junk pre-haggled price so we're going to be scrapping this transformer in a future episode it's the biggest one i've had so far um as far as i can tell it's about 400 pound uh we've got that welder that welder um we've got all these sealed units uh a whole bunch of motors in those totes motor in the bushes over there this generator these two um forklift battery thingamajiggies this small generator make sure you bleep bloop in the comments and tell me what you want to see first and then we've been cleaning up the yard i know it doesn't look like it, but there's actually quite a bit less here. This won't take long. Um, then uh, that's panel box from that motor from the generator, the 9,000 pound generator. We've got some stuff over here from the trailer. That's from the trailer. Um, What I did today is I took it in a load of aluminum. So this was piled way high with aluminum siding. Clean that all up, got her into the truck. You'll see the what it weighs, what it pays soon. This is the little bit of aluminum I got left to process. We'll get that early next week, maybe tomorrow. I don't know. Stop asking all the hard questions. This will probably be the next video for sure. So the bleep bloop will be for the next video after that. Um, we're gonna try cooking it. So I'm gonna build an oven and uh, we're gonna put it in and see if we can't loosen that up. Got this whole bunch of 
iron and stuff to pick up and bring over to the scrapyard. On Monday, I have six fridges and three stoves to pick up from a customer. And then I'll bring these in at the same time. Then um, what we're gonna be doing is getting this thing ready for uh, putting the new deck, putting the walls on, putting the crane on. Um, and then we're gonna be ready to go do some street scrapping. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna start doing uh, street scrapping for the summer. But I know a lot of you guys like that kind of thing, so I have a route already planned. It'll probably be one or two days a week. Hope you can put up with that. Now, the other thing is what we're going to be doing is um, the car show season starting, so make sure to catch that on the Chrome Culture. I'll link that down below. Here is my prepared, so that'll go all at the same time as uh, as the motor and the armature and all that stuff, right? So the prepared is going to go in here. Well, not that. That's going in shred. The the galvanized cheap angle iron. Um. So for the ones that haven't done it yet, I need you to do me a favor. Yes, go down to Chrome Culture, subscribe to that. If you want to see the car action, subscribe to Chrome Culture. I'll make sure I put that in the description. But the most important thing I need you guys to do, my daughter started a cooking channel this week. Yeah, cooking channel. And she's pretty good. Her stuff's pretty freaking yummy so um make sure you check that out she's only got like two or three videos up right now maybe by the time um you see this video there'll be more because i don't know when you're watching it how would i know so make sure to check out leah lee and that will definitely be in the description so make sure you click and, you know, and go over there and uh, subscribe to the subscription thing. It costs you nothing. It's cheap. You get some good content. And she does a pretty good job on the, the, the videographer stuff. So you need to go take a look. Subscribe, watch a couple videos, tell her nice junk sent you, right? Leave a bleep bloop in one of the videos. Just say, hey, we're here to support you, girl. You're doing great. That's all I want you to do. So now on to what did it weigh, what did it pay? So here's our load of aluminum. As you can see, it's stacked. Floor to ceiling, wall to wall. <coughs> There's some siding, some sheet. Some cast, some extruded. I didn't get it all, so probably next week I'll process the rest and get her off. So I guess we'll uh, see you in a bit. So it's time for what does it weigh? What does it pay? And I'm emphasizing this over and over for e-waste Mike. He loves it. So my load of aluminum I showed you earlier. Wow, that was uh, 208 pounds of cast and sheet. Uh, yeah, I get the same price. Doesn't matter if it's painted, if it's not painted, uh, if it's cast or sheet, or makes it way easy. So anyways, 208 pounds, 60 cents a pound, 124.80. Then we've got the aluminum, the extruded aluminum. I know it doesn't say that it just says aluminum but I know I'm the one that brought it in stop arguing okay so aluminum the second aluminum 
24 pounds, 70 cents a pound. $16.80. And then that's the total of $141.60. That's pretty cool, eh? Look at that signature. Mom always said I should have been a doctor. So this one here, I don't know what he was thinking, but this is going to be long. Um, so first item was uh, number two, clean copper, 475 a pound, 230 pounds. Um, then it's clean number one copper, 28 pounds of $5 a pound. Yellow brass is 32 pounds, $3.10 a pound for $21.40. The bright and shiny, so bear bright. Four pounds at five thirty-five a pound, um, which was forty buck. Clean number one. Uh, I had eight pounds of that. Five dollars a pound, fifty dollar. So I used to get. One price for all insulated cable. Now they've decided to do 40 and 50% and um, Romex. So, anyways, 40% um, extension cord, 40 pounds, $1.25 a pound, $31.25. Insulated copper, number two, 50%. So that would be the wire again. Um, 16 pounds, $1.96 a pound uh, for 30 buck. Then we're gonna do extension cords again, 24 pounds, still $1.25. And that is $53.90. Insulated copper number two, two pounds. I don't know why they made this receipt this way. It's not real YouTube friendly, but whatever. So, $1.96 a pound. Um, clean number two copper wire pipe. Uh, so this one was four seventy five a pound, 136 pounds, 646 bucks. Again, this one, this was clean number two, but um, heavy on the number three side. So they negotiated a price of $3.40 instead of the four seventy five dollars because it had fiberglass on it and uh, they don't really have a number three. But it was just too dirty for number two. So um, they gave me uh, 196 pounds, $3.40 a pound for 666.40, a total of 2871.80. Well, that was some nice junk. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. You probably didn't. Make sure to like, share, and subscribe. And we'll catch you all next weekend.